Our understanding of Hitler is central to our self-understanding. And if anyone can advance the understanding of Hitler, then that is well worth undertaking. Well, good luck. We've seen Hitler's dogs, his women, his cars, his food, his generals, his secretaries, his secret weapons, and his drug habit. Never before seen footage in glorious color. Fascinating fascism. Which begs the question, is it possible to make a film like this without contributing to the expansion of the Nazi cinematic universe? Fortunately, you cannot put Hitler on a psychologist's couch. My core disorder or schizophrenic, I think any psychiatric diagnosis has been assigned to him. The problem that we have is not that the Nazis were inhuman, but that they were human. It can start again. The world is nationalism. Nazis! 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 They were looking for a savior. And that is the danger of the times we are now living through when the very concept of truth itself has become questioned. The minute you're trying to give a rational explanation for an irrational sentiment, you're going to be lost. I think we're lost. We have demagogues now that can reach untold numbers of people instantaneously. If there's no limit to what you can say, it's easy to believe there's no limit to what you can do. History is not propaganda. The Nazi wanted to hide it. We want to discover. We only want to get to the truth in history. And if this history can be rewritten, any history can be rewritten. <laughs>